Today, we're hitting the nitrous button and burning rubber as we rank the 10 fastest Ford muscle cars ever made. From the legendary Shelby GT500 to the modern Mustang Monsters, we're revving up for a horsepower showdown. Get ready for earth-shaking exhaust notes, mind-blowing top speeds, and iconic muscle car design. The 1967 Ford Mustang Shelby GT500 Super Snake was a special one-off muscle car. Ford and Goodyear teamed up to create a car that would show off Goodyear's new tires. Carroll Shelby, a famous race car driver, took a regular GT500 and made it super powerful. He put in a giant engine that made 520 horsepower, which was incredible for a car back then. This engine wasn't just for show, it was meant to win races. But a car with all that power needs to be controllable too. And Shelby made sure the car could handle the engine by adding special parts that kept it stable at high speeds. This meant drivers could use all that power safely. The Super Snake wasn't just fast in a straight line, it could also corner well. However, this amazing car was never meant to be sold in stores. Only one Super Snake was ever built, making it incredibly rare and valuable. Today, it's the most expensive Mustang ever sold, costing millions of dollars. The 2023 Ford Mustang Shelby GT500 is the undisputed champion of the modern Ford stable. It's a technological marvel wrapped in a retro-inspired muscle car package. Unlike the tire-shredding beast of the 60s and 70s, this machine relies on cutting-edge engineering. A supercharged 5.2-liter V8 engine unleashes a mind-blowing 760 horsepower, propelling it from 0 to 60 miles per hour in a very fast manner of only 3.3 seconds. This pure, unadulterated speed, making it the most powerful Ford ever produced. And the GT500 isn't just about straight-line dominance. Advanced aerodynamics keep it planted on the track, ensuring it corners with precision. It's a testament to Ford's ability to blend classic muscle car looks with modern performance, creating a legend for a new generation. The 1971 Ford Mustang Boss 429 was a conform special, a street legal version of a race car built to meet racing regulations. Nicknamed Boss 9 for its massive 429 cubic inch engine, it pumped out over 480 horsepower, making it a true force on the road. This wasn't a car built for comfort. It was a raw, powerful machine designed for speed. Unlike the later supercharged Shelby GT500, the Boss 429 relied on pure engine muscle. While some modern Fords boast higher horsepower, the Boss 429 significance lies in its historical context. It brought NASCAR power to the streets, thrilling drivers and solidifying Ford's dominance in muscle car racing. Its legacy lives on not just for its speed, but for its connection to the golden age of American muscle. The 1969-1974 Torino GT Cobra 429 was a powerful muscle car that could compete with the famous Mustang. It had a large 429 engine and was very fast. Unlike some other muscle cars, the Torino GT was also comfortable, with a smooth ride and nice extras inside. And this made it a surprise for other drivers. It looked ordinary, but it could beat them easily. The Torino GT wasn't the lightest car, but it offered a great mix of power and comfort, making it special in the world of muscle cars. It was perfect for someone who wanted a fast car that was also enjoyable to drive every day. The 1970-73 through 73 Ford Falcon XB GT, though not American-made, deserves recognition as an honorary muscle car legend. Built by Ford Australia, the XB GT was a tire-smoking bruiser that carved its own niche in the world of muscle. The nickname refers to the XB GT, or simply the GT. It was immortalized in the dystopian film Mad Max, solidifying its bad boy image. Under the hood, a potent 351 cubic inch V8 engine resided, pumping out enough power to make it a dominant force in Australian motorsport. While not the most powerful car on this list by a long shot, it held its own against competitors. The XB GT wasn't a lightweight racer. It was a well-built, full-size car that could handle itself on the track. What truly set the XB GT apart was its surprising practicality. Unlike some American muscle cars that prioritized power over comfort, the XB GT offered a decent amount of space and a relatively comfortable ride. This unique combination made it a popular choice among drivers down under who craved muscle car performance in a car suitable for everyday driving. 
The XB GT was a true street bruiser with a surprising amount of everyday appeal. The 1993 Ford SVT Mustang Cobra R was a stripped-down, track-focused monster built for the SCCA Mustang Cobra R race series. Creature comforts were ditched for lightweight racing seats, and aero mods like a giant rear wing transformed it into a corner-carving champion. A bump in power from the familiar 5-liter V8, along with weight reduction, made it a force on the track. This barely street-legal beast was a homologation special, a testament to Ford's muscle car heritage. The 1967 Ford Mustang GT 5.0 was a game-changer. It had a new fuel-injected engine with 225 horsepower, which was a lot back then. This powerful engine was also good on gas, showing muscle cars could be modern. And it went from 0 to 60 miles per hour really fast, like under 6 seconds, making it exciting to drive. This mix of power and practicality made it super popular. The 1987 Mustang GT 5.0 set the stage for future fast Mustangs, proving Ford wouldn't forget muscle cars. The 1969 through 1973 Ford Mustang Boss 302 wasn't about brute force, it was a precision instrument built for handling. Unlike some muscle cars focused on tire shredding horsepower, the Boss 302 was a lightweight, high revving machine designed for agility on the racetrack. Under the hood sat a specially developed 302 cubic inch V8, known for its responsiveness and ability to reach high RPMs. This focus on revs translated to a car that begged to be pushed hard on twisty roads. While not the most powerful on the drag strip, the Boss 302 excelled on the track due to its exceptional handling and nimbleness. This wasn't just any Mustang. It had a racing pedigree. Built for homologation, a process of creating street-legal versions of race cars, the Boss 302 is a direct descendant of Ford's dominance in the Trans Am series. Its racing heritage and focus on handling cemented its place in muscle car history, making it a legend among driving enthusiasts who value precision over raw power. The 1994 Ford Mustang SVT Cobra marked a significant turning point for the iconic pony car. It wasn't just a hopped-up Mustang. The SVT, or Special Vehicle Team, took things a step further. Upgraded suspension with stiffer components sharpened handling, making it a true driver's car. Aerodynamic tweaks like a unique front fascia and a more aggressive rear wing improved stability at high speeds. While it shared the 5-liter V8 with the standard Mustang GT, the SVT Cobra received a power bump, pushing it close to 300 horsepower. This transformed the Mustang from a fun cruiser to a serious performance machine ready to take on the curves and challenge rivals on the open road. In the shadow of its flamboyant cousin, the Mustang, lurked the 1967 through 1970 Mercury Cougar Eliminator. Now this often overlooked muscle car offered a unique blend of style and performance. The Eliminator wasn't a budget-friendly option. It boasted a standard 351 cubic inch V8 engine with the top of the line packing a monstrous 427 cubic inch beast. This engine turned out over 400 horsepower, making it a worthy competitor on the drag strip. But the Eliminator wasn't all about straight-line dominance. It differed from the Mustang with a more luxurious touch. Blacked-out exterior trim and racing stripes gave it an aggressive look, while retaining a hint of sophistication. So the Cougar Eliminator wasn't just a powerful muscle car, it was a luxurious alternative for those who crave performance in a stylish package. Hey, that's it for our look at the 10 fastest Fords ever built. From the legendary Shelby GT500s to the tire-shredding modern Mustangs, Ford's history is packed with muscle. Hey, if you enjoyed this trip down memory lane, leave us a thumbs up and subscribe for more classic car content. And in the comments below, let us know which Ford muscle car gets your heart racing the most.